Hey! Steve like, likes frosting boobs. We're playing Tales from the Borderlands. I'm actually really stoked for this. It's zero. You're zero. Thanks. We're playing Time to Make Terrible Decisions. Loading the game. And, and not feel good about them. Yummy wants us to go to Disneyland again soon. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Why'd you say it like that? She messaged me. Oh. Yeah. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Because we didn't know that. Yeah. We didn't know that that's how Telltale games work. Back we, again oh, whoops. to hear another story of Yay, Marcus. fortune and unthinkable Peru. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora. We're told to contain mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people called them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, somewhat unsporting. <laughs> He ran the corporation Hyperia and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack, but forget the adventurers who risk it all for less uh, obvious rewards. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. My favorite intro of a Borderlands game or DLC had to be Ned's, the, the zombie island oh, Doctor yeah. Ned, because it's just like he's telling the story. The kid is like, "You said a swear. <laughs> you were adopted." <laughs> Which fun. then. Does Marcus have a kid? Yeah. <laughs> that they just never ever talk about ever? Yeah. Well, they talk about him in the second Borderlands DLCs. How's the scat gonna die this time? I don't know. They're not doing that? He's already dead. Damn. Look at ruined it already. It's you. It's you. It's me? It's you. <laughs> what do you mean it's me? That's you. That's the character you're gonna play. That's you. Over at Prosperity Junction. Mm -hmm. Fiona! That's also you. Come on! We can work this out! Try it on two people. Mm -hmm. A multiple personality disorder. Mm -hmm. Fiona? <laughs> what, is there some sort of radiation leak? I don't know. You won't make all of his decisions. I'll make all of her decisions. <laughs> Deal? <laughs> Deal? <laughs> <laughs> it's a two-player game! <laughs> yeah! Welcome to the first episode of Co-Opportunity. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> oh god. You got a, you got a decision uh, make. What is happening right now? I ask the questions. Okay, then do you mind asking yourself what you're doing? Oh! <laughs> what the hell? Tell me about the Gordas Project. <laughs> Is that what this is about? <laughs> Look, Gordas is bad business. If you want a real hot investment, I am on the ground floor of some property on E. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Oh, Come that's not a good spot to mark. I'm not a patient person. You can get some robot it's genitalia. It'll be okay. Oh, yeah. yeah, I can yeah, be like, well, um, where do you start <laughs> when you're getting dragged through the desert and, uh. <clears throat> from the beginning. Right. the intro. Ooh. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. And Handsome Jack? He was the baddest guy of them all. He looks like him. Must feel good. I wanted to be just you know? like him. It's his son. Take it. It's yours, right? I mean, you always said that. <laughs> Everyone did. I gotta be honest. I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but uh, but hey, here Which we are. Which resulted in a company overflowing 
with asshole. Animals. When Handsome Jack died, it somehow got even worse. It took some time to fit in. But a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends, I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives for the best. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're going to buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. <laughs> Your best friend. You'll be rolling in it. Even exec in Hyperion comes with expectations. I think I'm gonna buy a gun. Yeah, there's this sniper rifle I've been looking at for a while now. Man, it's a doll, right? A uh, Reaver's Edge. And it is awesome. You just feel so powerful holding it. I wonder if it's a red text gun. We're meeting with a vet afterwards. What? I don't know if you picked I don't think I picked in time. <laughs> yeah. Sounds good. Look. We had to do a that lot of pretty fast timer at this point. For, well, yeah, that many sure, choices. Every night it haunts my dreams, only but three. doesn't matter now. You made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mind deal we put together. Thanks for the help, Vaughn. Really. I couldn't have done this without you and Yvette. Hey, man, don't sweat it. Uh, I'm just right. glad we even got you Better here. Better not. You know, I crunched the numbers one night and figured out there was a 45% chance someone would kill you before this day. Glad that didn't happen. Me too. It was a uh, real touch and go there for a bit. All right, man. Let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back. Uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. What's up with your David Bowie yes, ass eyes? Uh, Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a sec. <clears throat> no, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you now. Peter! Yeah, but I don't want it, friend. I want it. Anymore. It's him. It's mm -hmm. a guy. Because black is better. Look, don't concern yourself with why. Okay, Jerry. Concern yourself <clears throat> with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. Company car. Didn't even have to ask. You look surprised to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick. So you might not have been in the loop, but it's for the better. At least for me. So where's Henderson? He, uh, stepped out. You're going to be reporting to me now. And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming to you. Well, that's a relief. Because <laughs> I thought this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? <laughs> For the exact same reason why North is North. Why the handsome guy always gets the girl. And why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a gun. <laughs> it's destiny, and men, <clears throat> real men, men like me, make their own. And you can hold a grudge if you like. No harm, no foul. Your thoughts are your own. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny. You don't want to be that man. Oh, he killed wow. him. Wow. I could not have timed that better. That really helps dramatically. <laughs> <laughs> Which is this. <clears throat> this promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny and put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digestructing in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, cool, listen. Uh, I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh, Are you buying this vault key, or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. 
Of course I'm still interested. I guess I'm near a computer. Damn, Elliot. Yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. So many things to do. What are you gonna look, look at the planet? Yeah, I want him, but she's. Yeah, yeah, no, but. Why do the biggest scumbags always have the best view? Three years sucking do up you to want the, guy. the money or not? Because I'm out the window, but I'm. <laughs> 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 it's not. No, it won't be a big deal. Unless. Vasquezzi. Vasquezzi? I guess I'm gonna rotate the key. Yes. You're gonna get caught. Smooth. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what we had before. Ooh, oh. you got you got a little eye power. I've got abilities. Sweet. Of course you have abilities. It's a goddamn Borderlands one. game. <laughs> Former. <laughs> Favorite donut. It kind of looks wrinkles. I want fucking donuts. Nice Damn it! Now I want donuts. Stupid guy. Uh, look, look, look. Are you going? Are you a Homo sapien? Rock and roll, lock and load, ain't no thing. Ironically. Why are you turning this into a thing? My blood pressure, though. Right Dead blood pressure. Not yet. Expensive. Yeah. Reviewing one encrypted file. Download and decrypt. Car, car, bulky. Isn't that the key the Jack had? I think so. Why are you trying to screw me on this? <coughs> oh, fine. Just wait there, okay? I can only be down it. If it's gonna be ten million dollars, I'm gonna need another hour or two. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there in a bit. Well, then just stay there. It's a tourist shop, right? Buy a mug or something. Sure. 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 Okay. Say hi to your mom. I found a mug that I need, Dear. and I'll show you during break. Is the one with the fox on it? And it says cock? Yeah. Yes. Oh, right. I, <laughs> I require that. that. Now, what were we talking about? Dicks. Before Space we ships. were. So, <laughs> my promotion. Interrupt. We were talking. <clears throat> we were talking about my promotion. All right, your uh, promotion. Anderson was a fool. He didn't know his place. He needed lesson number one: humility. But you, I respect you, Reese. That's why I'm going to make you assistant vice janitor. What? Best. No, no. Job. Mm -hmm. you can't I'm the ever. boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report to Sewage Scout 23. Effective immediately. Oh, shit. I'm just gonna be all. I've had to do worse in my career. That's the spirit, Reese. Nothing teaches you humility faster than scrubbing toilets. You're dismissed, Reese. You didn't threaten him? No. I would have threatened him. <laughs> but then he would have remembered that. Yeah. <laughs> so that way at the end of the game when he come back and I'll kill him. You know like that scene from The Walking him. Dead. But now he'll be like, I thought you liked toilets. <laughs> <laughs> well, Rick promised to kill that guy. And he did. Yeah, I know. What the hell oh, was shit. that? He can't do this to us. Oh, he the just did. finale. I haven't watched no, 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 it. This can't the mid-season finale. Yeah. Finished, it was so good. You know who this place is. There's blood in the water, and everyone can smell it. No, sharks. no, no, they can't. Mm -hmm. Not yet, unless you don't quiet do, down. Do, 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 do. I'm down, no one can figure something out. What? You, you heard me. Yet. Good job, Steve. <laughs> what? I don't know. Your friend knocked something over. Senior Vice Janitor Reese to Sector D451 for trash cleanup. Because that is your job now. <laughs> Clean up trash with your bare hands. Sorry, you were saying something? I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? I thought you were getting a promotion. 
Trash duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. <coughs> Vesquez screwed me out of the promotion. He threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to trash man. Holy crap. So does that mean you're not buying? My other best friend. <laughs> Lunch leech. <leads. laughs> well, just try and lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's gonna pay. Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type to... can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. What? No way. We hit back. We could throw him out in the airlock. Worked on Henderson. Yeah. Except I'm not a murderer. Oh. Right. There's no way Hyperion would let Vasquez do that to him unless there was a good reason. The ball key. That's it. What vault key? Vasquez has a deal set up on Pandora to buy one. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is his vault keys. It's perfect. I mean, not only do we screw over Vasquez, we have a freaking vault key. What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? Oh, this game already. More. Yeah. yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Hold, please. Done. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm mean, counting. I mean, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Cool. <clears throat> well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Right? Hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two. You know, things get dicey. Look, it's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends. Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Come on, I'll buy you the lunch I owe you when we get back. Fine. But you're buying me lunch now <laughs> and when you get back. <laughs> that's all it took was lunch? Done. We got a couple hours. Steve, go steal shit for me. I'll buy you lunch. Go withdraw the okay. cash. All right. <laughs> I'll get you guys clearance for Pandora. What do you want? Get geared up and issue you a standard high What do you buy? What? What do you sell? Really? Hello, you can't drink for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible or something? Sure. Yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected? Right? Look, it just... You're gonna steal something. I uh, figure... No. No, don't worry. He's gonna steal that guy's car. Car in mind. 